the face of pure horror. Oh. Hi guys, it's Talisha and today I'm competing in the Silver Heels Hunter Trials. So yeah, um, Charlie is at my window. So I'll show you what I'm wearing. I'm wearing this turquoise top because I have cross country first and then I'm wearing my carrots white breeches. Woo! Okay, so unfortunately dad didn't start filming at the start. He filmed as I came out of the water, which was a shame because she went through the water so nicely, but he didn't actually realize I left the start box. So I'm about a quarter way through the course now and we're coming up to a jump which I didn't think would be too much of an issue. It was a scary looking jump and it was probably the largest one in our course but we got a refusal, it was quite a messy refusal but I just took her around again and we jumped it. As I said, um, oh I didn't say this, this is a training day before I went and actually at this stage I thought this was a competition so I was taking this like more seriously than I needed to but after cross country I found out it was just a training day and that there's like it, yeah <laughs> so but anyway the rest of this course is completely clear she went away away <laughs> sorry she went around the course so confidently I was so proud of her she was so bold she didn't look at any jump apart from that one she refused on and now we disappear in the bush and this is the end of it um yeah I was very happy this is the best cross-country course we've ever done we normally get a couple refusals but um we only had an issue at that one jump which was great and the water she canted through she trotted out of it but she canted through it so I, which has never happened normally she looks at the water but she just canted straight into it which was absolutely amazing and I was so happy with her. She was such a good girl. <laughs> now, for the show jump round, I really just wanted to keep her at a slow, steady pace because we're not used to doing optimum time show jump rounds and we're used to going quite fast when we do show jumping and she's really good at just really going fast and just killing it she's a speedy show jumper so i really just wanted to keep her steady um we get a few awkward distances but i was pretty happy with how consistent she was with her speed throughout this round she was quite nice and um yeah as i said she was feeling a bit lazy in this anyway so it wasn't too hard to keep her at this slow pace but um and we get so many awkward strides it was just it, this course didn't feel great um luckily it's only low so it doesn't really matter that we had awkward strides or anything but um i'm pretty sure i remember this part of the course was a bit better the end half was way better than the first half but she has a little flying change here, but she only changes her front end, <laughs> which is our issues with our flying changes at the moment. But yeah, so I was really pleased with her. Um, she tried really hard and I was pretty happy with her. I could have ridden her better, just given her a little pat, but yeah. I've got the keys. Oh, I've been recording this whole conversation. Oh, big yawn. So we are home of poulticed Jep's legs and um, today went pretty good. I was pr really happy with how she went. I'm feeling really sick right now, so I'm sorry about that. Um, but yeah, I was really happy with how she went. It was a training day, so there were no places or ribbons or anything. So it was just like for experience. <laughs> Jeff. But I was really happy with her. It's the best cross country we've done. Because we've never gone clear in a cross country. But at every, at a lot of the jumps, she'll be very like looky and not very confident but she didn't look at any of the jumps apart from the one she refused at and she canted through the water she didn't hesitate at the water either um normally she'll hesitate then just trot through it but she canted through majority of it which was really nice show jumping was really good as well that was completely clear um she did not feel herself i think she's a bit off today we're just gonna give her this week off um she didn't feel 100 percent during show jumping she did in cross country but not show jumping show jumping she just felt um a, a bit slow so um normally in show jumping i'm having to hold her back and i don't know it could have just been because she was tired after cross country because we didn't have a huge break in between and it was a big cross country course and you know sh she's not an eventer we do we normally just show so it's a bit of a change but yeah the 
um, lady who was running show jumping was talking to me after and ah uh, no spoke to me after my show jump round and said that it was a really good round she said that I rode really well and that she did really well she thought it was a really really nice round yeah she's just settling in and then we're gonna put her back in the paddock with Kai but yeah I was hoping to vlog more than I did today but things got stressful I got really really sick and I just feel <laughs> Jep she's like what are you doing <laughs> Jep the nun <laughs> she's like Plez oh you did this up so loosely or did you do it so you could put it around her no she's not sitting properly on her not... <laughs> pull it off her ears no, not... oh I do it up on the tightest so yeah anyway um we're gonna put Jeff back now and I'm sorry this vlog wasn't as exciting as I was hoping it would be. I just didn't really feel that well. I still feel like I'm about to pass out. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. That was said really weird. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I'll see you guys next week. All right, say bye. Ooh, Jeff's says. The face of pure horror. Oh.